I grew up loving to read and to write, so that was always something I loved, but I never thought I would do it professionally. Um, when I was a professor, a nursing professor at uh, Georgetown and Columbia and at Yale, they push you to you know, take that right into the next level. So you work with uh, graduate students on their thesis, and um, I started, I had to publish something, so I published my first research paper on midwifery in a black community from slavery to 1940, and then a group of us, a group of professors, did a textbook. So that's sort of when I started pushing myself into actually publishing. And then I got talked into writing a memoir um, in that was published in 1997, um, and that was based out of an interview that was done for Ebony Magazine, and the interviewer, who became my friend, said, you know, you have a story to tell. I ended up um, telling a story about my adolescence and abuse and, and paralleling it to what was happening with my brother and his drugs and, you know, um, and that whole recovery process and, and the trauma of that. I started writing about it on legal pad, and that became my first, you know, commercial book, was that memoir. <laughs>